Sunday night, Medford police responded to these apartment complexes for a disturbance call. When they arrived on scene, they heard a gunshot and saw a man running out toward the parking lot. That man was 40 year old Jonathan Kinsella, a wanted felon. 36 year old Corey Thompson says he shot at Kinsella because he was trying to break in through his back door. This is the end result. You know, you break into someone's house, there's consequences. Thompson says he grabbed his AR-15 assault rifle and told Kinsella to stop. When I'm dealt with a stressful situation, being a veteran from the Iraq and Afghanistan war, it's just natural. I jump into combat mode. I told him specifically, I'm going to give you a warning shot. But police say that was not the right move. There was nothing that the suspect was doing that was aggressive enough to justify the shooting. In fact, the, the suspect was walking away. Thompson was charged with unlawful use of a weapon, menacing and reckless endangering. I can see where they're coming from with, with those kinds of ordinance and stuff. And I understand, yes, I discharged my weapon, but I was careful not to fire it at anybody's residence. You know, it was at the ground specifically. But police say bullets from assault rifles can skip. They don't just hit something and absorb, especially something that that high velocity. It'll skip off objects and could wind up hitting, going into a house, going through a wall, through a window. Police took Thompson's assault rifle because they say it was used in the commission of a crime. They say if a judge finds Thompson not guilty, he will get his assault rifle back. In Medford, Sharon Co. News Watch 12.